We're turning for 2024 Black Hill Statue Rodeo. The Cowboys are back in town. My name is Ty Dean. Very glad to be back here once again for the long week of the Black Hill Statue and Rodeo. Before we get going, I'd like to know how many of our friends here tonight are from our great state of South Dakota. Where's our South Dakota fans at? All right. Now, I know we have a lot of visitors here. Where's all our out-of-staters at, huh? Yeah, thank you for making a trip. We're going to be seeing contestants right here, of course, it's from South Dakota, all the way from Nebraska, New Mexico Cowboy, along with the Montana of Wyoming. So I tell you what, put your hands together for all of our contestants. Let's get, them, let's get them fired up a little bit on a Friday night. What do you say? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, before we start this great show tonight, it is only right that we take the time and ask our Lord to bless all of us here tonight. So join me, if you would, for a moment of prayer. Our gracious and heavenly Father, we come to you and we ask you to be with us tonight. But we do know that you're always with us. God, can we ask a favor and have you place guardian angels around the arena here tonight to watch over our cowboys and our cowgirls, of course. God, keep an eye on the great livestock as well. I'm just going to ask you simply, please bless all the great fans that join us here tonight. Father, those are simple things we ask from you. I guess while we have the chance and we're talking right now, I want to thank you for the greatest gift ever given, and that is your son, Jesus Christ, and that is whose name I pray. Amen. Amen. Ladies and gentlemen, our national anthem tonight being brought to us by Martin Savory. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mr. Brandon Jones.
So let's move around to the next cowboy, William Adikowski. He rides quite a bit. He's 14 years of age out of Rain, North Dakota. How many fans made a trip from North Dakota? Oh yeah, put on the miles to join us here for the stock show. We appreciate you. All right, William Adikowski, let's ride. Yes, look at this. 14 year old cowboy. Gotta be feeling good about that one. And I'd like to introduce to you our pickup man. How about we give William a 75 point ride tonight? All right, let's keep her going. Let's bring in our third bareback rider tonight. We got eight of them Riley Weevil. Oh yeah, we got some Riley Weevil fans here. He's out of Rapid City, the hometown cowboy. He's seven years of age, and he's ready to ride one. This is gonna be his first time riding tonight. He's ready to show us how to do it. All right, we are about ready to bring out Riley Weevil. Make it some final cut. We're back for game. He's ready to go. Come on. First time for Riley riding. Yeah, 
Big 50 points for Kate. All right. This is going to be Cruz Baylor, Cowboy. All right, buddy. Hang on tight. Hang on tight. He's hurt. He's hurt. Oh. Uh-oh. Well, he didn't make the whistle. Give that young Cowboy a big round of applause tonight. Thank you, Rapid City. All right, Cove Howie, our Cowboy, eight years of age. Whoa, he had his hand killed up there. Woo! Well, you want the jitterbug near the bucket horns? Three, two, one, two, his boss. Tegan Williams, going to be our first Santa Bronca mini coming out tonight. Seven years of age for the young man. And he is another first time rider as well. The horse's name, Rocker. The Cowboy Dean Williams coming to us out of Sturgis, South Dakota. He's coming out of bucket sheet number seven here tonight. All right, Rock. Tegan Williams, let's ride one. This is the first time for the Cowboy. Only weighing 62 pounds, soaking wet. He's ready to go. Here we go. Woo! Hang on, buddy. Hang on. Yes, sir. There it is. Tegan Williams, first one out in the mini saddle on Friday. First timer riding in the saddle on Friday as well. Oh, I think he's going to be hooked. How you feeling, Tegan? Is that fun? Yeah. Good deal. All right, we'll keep it going. It'll be 33 points for Tegan Williams. All right, we're going to move right down the line. Mason Booth. Now we got an age group from 7 all the way to 16 in our mini Santa Brown Riders. So Mason Booth, eight-year-old cowboy out of Vivian, South Dakota. The horse's name is Pepper. Oh, let's ride one tonight. Come on, Mason. That whistle, no problem for Mason. They raised it pretty darn good. Cowboys and Cowboys are going to run that big We'll get them on the ticket here. About a 38 point ride for Mason Moe, 38 for the Cowboys. And he's still a beginner, but he's been on the front end since he's about three or four in the last summer. Now with this age group, it's starting out at 10 years of age, we go up to 8 seconds. We're moving to our next cowboy, Ian Furley. Ian Furley, 12 years of age. He's ridden a few times. Silly Sally is the name of the bucking horse, and this young man is coming to us out of Ulrich, South Dakota. Well, I'm sure we got some Ian Furley fans here tonight. Where you at? Here we go. Cheer him on. But he still gets up with a big old smile on his face, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, lost the sound and everything. Wow. We're going to have to take that sound to the power washer and we get her home. Woo. That was a tough one to ride there. Well, one of our oldest in our sound rock run. We've got a 15 year old cowboy, about ready to nod his head, Connor Krauser. Elfu, South Dakota, Cowboy. We're going to be watching this Cowboy a lot in his young future between the junior rodeos, the high school rodeos, all the way up to, to the amateurs, and of course, the pro rodeos someday. Come on! You have the last name, Krauser. Well, you have the reputation of being one heck of a cowboy. We got down on the ground. There's another big smile on the young cowboy's face. How about 56 points for Connor Krauser? Our next cowboy coming up, 
Hunter Hahn, we watched him earlier in the fairback riding. He's back again. He loves getting on bucket horses. He can ride barebacks, saddle broncs, get on some steers. He's ready to get, get on some mini bulls later on in the summer. He's quite the, the all-around cowboy. Hunter home, 12 years of age. He comes to us out of Ethan, South Dakota. And he's ready to ride here in Rockland. Come on.
so many horses to town. Gonna be a 49 point ride for the Cowboy, 4-9. Bradley Siska is getting ready. Oh, we got some Bradley Siska fans here tonight. We'll get the arena cleared out. We're moving up to bucket sheet number three for the young cowboy, 23 years of age. He's ready to ride. He's got his head down tight. He's got his safety vest on. Kevlar vest right there. Yeah. All right, cowboy. Show us how to do it. Friday night wild ride, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, couldn't be at a better place here in Rapid City. Here we go. Oh, a sick jam. Xavier LaPlante, I tell you what, 
The talent is here tonight. Talent is here tonight between the horses and the cowboys. I'd like to thank all of our volunteer helpers here as well. Our rodeo judges, Jess Robertson, Sam Stoddard. And of course, our pickup man, TK Sams and Troy Browns are going to do it without you. All right, we got the hometown cowboy, Sam Hamilton, down in that bucket chute, about ready to nod his head. You know what to do when we crack open that chute gate. Five rides down. 
cowboy very well around this horse. Wearing some camo. He comes to us from Pine Ridge, South Dakota. You want to know some facts about Pine Ridge? Pine Ridge has the best Tucker Johns in the state of South Dakota. What? Sam Stoddard is shaking his head no. Well, I'm going to have to disagree with him. It is a fact. So 84 at the top of the leaderboard, 82 at second place, 79. At third at 77 at fourth place, here we go! Your yellow horse coming down too soon. Gonna be taking a no score here tonight for the Pine Ridge Cowboy. We're down to our final. He's a hometown cowboy of Rapid City. 